someone were to walk up to you and ask you, of course, I already take the BTT, um, which is like something I do on a daily basis. I put it on a, in a blender bottle, and it's one of the main things I make sure I pack with me every day to sip on it throughout the day. Nice, that Andy. helps me. That helps me a lot. Like when I get a craving and that I feel like I need something sweet, I just sip on it a little bit, and and then I follow it dude. up with some water. You're and a I'm, poster I'm like, boy, man. You're a poster yeah. boy for everything we talk about here. That's awesome. And so, so what so, you want a product? You're thinking a pro what product would you use? So is my that... question is my question is when 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 people are having issues financially and they think that it's difficult for them to carry a ketogenic diet, on I, I want an example of veggie juices. What is something that I'm, what I'll is tell something you right now. they can have? I'll tell you right now. Breakfast, lunch to dinner. Veggie juices are amazingly satisfying, amazingly filling, and ridiculously cheap. You can make an awesome veggie juice for two bucks in a Vitamix. The Vitamix is going to be a little pricey, but it, um, once you invest in that or a Nutribullet, now they have cheaper ones. I yeah. like my Vitamix. Now they have cheaper ones. You want to keep the fiber. You, the juicers okay. of old, where you lose the fiber, that misses the point. The fiber is okay. a vital part of the plant. And so between the fiber and the electrolytes, not only are juices incredibly filling, they're incredibly stabilizing for the blood sugar. That's, and they're cheap. And yeah. make, sure you, make sure you combine your juices, your uh, vegetables, and your juice. There's blends of certain things that, that taste good together. For example, tomato, uh, celery, which is extremely important, extremely important, is a rich source of nitrogen. This is why it's so important, celery, even though it might look like rabbit food, as my dad used to say. Same with lettuce, although uh, celery in particular is really neat. Nitrogen, uh, which is very important for the digestive tract, is, has an alkaline taste. It's a little strong, but if you blend it with an acid, like tomato, it cuts it. And if you put something neutral, like cucumber in there, it almost sweetens it a little bit, and playing around yeah. with the blends of your vegetables is extremely helpful uh, for palatability, for taste. Another thing that's, uh, that's really important for taste is salt and spices. Between salt and spices and the correct blend of acid and alkaline uh, in your juice, it'll be so delicious, you, you, you'll want to drink the entire blender full. It'll be that tasty and that delicious. Think the best V8 you ever had. And because of the fiber and the electrolytes, it's an unbelievably satisfying, and the whole thing will cost you less than two bucks. How's that for cheap, Andy? That, 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 sounds, just right? about, that sounds just about right on point. All right, and I know you know that because you've done it yourself. Hey, I want to move on. Oh, I got a bunch of calls here. Anything else, bro? Thank you. Thank no, you so thank much for sharing so that. Much. That was awesome. That was awesome. Thank you. Love those success stories, you guys. Andy's not a doctor. He knows more than his doctor. He, he's lived it. He's lived these ideas. All right, Colin in Oklahoma City. What's up? Welcome to the Bright Side. Hey, how's it, how's it been? It's going, go it's going good, Colin. What's going on, man? Well, I just want to thank that caller uh, right? for, uh, for just everything he just said and uh, – not only that, too, because me and my wife have been motivated to get on the ketone diet. Uh, I think I talked to you a couple weeks ago about it. Okay. And, what did, have uh, you, are you on it? Have you started? We, we, are just, we have just now started or, you know, uh, changing our, all of our food in the kitchen. Are uh, you the guy who had the baby? Your wife had a baby or, or she was postpartum depression. Was that you? Yes. 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 Okay. Gotcha. 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 So how's she doing? She's doing pretty good. She's, uh, she's getting better and better every day. And, uh, awesome. How old's your baby? Uh, huh? How old's your baby? Uh, about a month and a half. Oh, and we're, wow. We're actually, How, have, we've actually having problems with him uh, gaining weight. We've been just strictly breastfeeding. Well, and, mom, uh, might, mom might need to start doing some stuff. Make sure mom's yeah. on whey protein. Does, can, mom, can she do whey? What's her name, by the way? What's your wife's name? Uh, Sarah. Can Sarah do whey protein? Yeah. Okay, have her do this uh, a good a really really good whey protein, one world whey or natural factors or something like that. Okay. And have her do an egg protein too. Egg protein and also okay. fats. Make sure she's getting enough EFAs and coconut oil and good fats. Okay. All okay. right. What else? Okay. Uh, I uh my daughter, my uh my oldest daughter patient. She went to her babysitters and she got a bunch of a bug bite over there and she okay. came back and then she started itching them like crazy what do you and mean now, bug bites what what, is, what are bug like ant bites mosquito bites what oh she i guess they uh they live she took them to her grandmother's place which is like in the like a farm or something no 
now a retirement home, and they have like bed bug issues, man. Oh no, that's awful. Get her some topical topical zinc oxide. Topical zinc oxide. Topical zinc oxide, and uh, you can also use calamine lotion, which contains. Well, they well they've already they've already we they've already healed they've already, I mean they've oh, okay. already, they're already gone. But now I'm it shows I mean she she's gonna be a knockout. And she has these legs, and you know, and like they, they have. You're afraid they, about scarring. You're afraid of scarring, yeah. is what you're saying. See scar. Yeah, you know, it looks like there's scarring on there. Here, I'll tell you what I'll do for you. Okay, Colin, send me an email, Ben at ksco dot com, and uh, I'll send you out some Omega Six healing cream on me. And that. that uh, K for King, S for Sam, C for Cat, O for Oscar. Dot com. I'll send you out some Omega-6 healing cream on me, and then you'll have to buy it after that. But that'll work. That might be all you need, the samples I'll send you. All right? Look, hey, I want to let you know I appreciate you so much, man. Oh. I, I'm, I'm a new listener the past couple months. I, I listened to Alex Jones right right after you. Nice. And and, uh, and I just like, well, hmm, what's on before this? And, man, I start listening to you, and I am I'm hooked. Oh, I, I love it. You Thank you, Colin. Yourself, you should call yourself Dr. Ben. No, I'm just pharmacist, Ben, but I'm, I'm the Alex Jones of nutrition. That's what I'm I, uh, tell you are. <laughs> I love Alex. I love Alex. All right. I got to go, Colin. Thank you, buddy. Take care, man. Thanks for sharing. All right. Carl, the Truth Raider, last word. You got it, man. What's going Benjamin. on? Benjamin. Well, yes, we Carl. forgot to say happy birthday to you. To me? <laughs> you just had a birthday, I guess, within the last couple of weeks. No. No? I tell you that? No, my birthday. I haven't had a I have a birthday coming up in you know soon, but not no. Oh, negative. Okay, well then better sooner than later. Happy double nickel. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> Did you call to wish me a happy birthday? Send me well, something. That, Send me a present. Questions about eye drops. Okay. There's one particular eye drop that that I take that is just fine. I don't have any problems with it when my eyes are red or irritated. But murine, clear eyes, and visine burn my eyes. What Those are on? well. I don't know what you're taking, what you're using, but the name of the, the that's a brand name you're talking about. What you got to look for is the chemical. There's a stuff called tetrahydrosoline that is used in a lot of those, and that has a kind of astringent effect. That's how it works. It kind of s closes the blood vessels, and astringents can be burning. So it might have something to do with that. But uh, unless I know the actual chemical names, I can't exactly tell you what's going on. But that's what it sounds like might be happening. Carl, that's it. We're out of time, right. bro. But thanks for calling, man. Have a great day, bro. We'll talk again soon. All right, that's it. We're out of time on the bright side. Tomorrow we'll continue talking about fats and fatty vitamins, and we'll probably get to the lymph, which is really cool because uh, there ain't no diseases without effect that don't also affect the lymph. Check out my uh, skincare products, skin health products at truthtreatments.com. Retinol, 5% gel especially. Truthtreatments.com. And if you want to join the Bright Side Ben team, love to have you aboard. Call 866-735-2470, and they can tell you all about it. We'll uh, be at you tomorrow with more good health information. Have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. I'm Pharmacist Ben. Bye for now.